Hey guys, it's Danielle. Welcome back to my channel. First, I need to give you an update on one other thing because I have not yet talked about it and that is these little beauties here. I got to see Morissette live here in Dallas and I never got to really talk about it and so I wanted to tell you guys my experience of what it was like hearing her sing live because I'm sure you guys wanna know, maybe you wanna know, I don't know. Obviously from someone who has only heard her sing through, you know, television or whether it be the live performances that we got to have from her concert that was live streamed or just hearing on YouTube, like completely different guys, completely different hearing her in person. It was nuts. Like, so I, I didn't really know what to expect because usually when I hear like a concert, I'm thinking like, I'm gonna stand, I'll be standing the whole time, you know, um, and it'll be like, I don't know. I haven't been to many concerts. <laughs> In a while but I was unsure what to expect but it was very like classy we were in more of an auditorium so it was more like I was going to see a musical and was sitting the whole time we were just sitting in this auditorium and um, it was a beautiful auditorium here in Dallas Charles W Eisman with two ends center it's right here in Richardson um, and it was amazing so first let's talk about the me meeting of Morissette first of all you saw, here are some pictures of me getting to meet Morissette and Dave. That was absolutely amazing. Uh, Dave and Morissette were so kind and nice enough to allow me to come and see them before the concert happened and before Morissette had her rehearsals for that evening. So basically I drove up to Richardson where they were staying in their hotel. They told me to meet them at two o'clock and I got there at two o'clock, I was ready to go. And um, we just got to chat for about 30 minutes or so before Morissette had to go to rehearsal cause she had a very busy day, but we got to just hang out and chat and meet and it was so fun fun to finally meet her in person and meet her and Dave and honestly it just felt like we had been like long lost friends or something that we were just catching up which was really nice Morissette makes you feel just so comfortable and she's so sweet she's so sweet her and Dave were so sweet it just felt like I was talking to longtime friends that I hadn't seen in a while and that's how it felt when, when I was on zoom too getting to interview and her and everything it was just a blast getting to talk to them we just talked about life like we just talked about how things were going um, I got to tell her that I was pregnant, which if you didn't see the video before this, I announced that I'm pregnant. She was so excited about that. Yeah, we just talked about like what's going on, why I moved here from California, just what you would talk about with a friend. It was really, really nice. And then it was really cold and windy that day. It was absolutely freezing. And I decided to wear a skirt that day and I was absolutely frozen, but it was fine. Then I went back home. I recorded a couple of videos for that day and then I drove up to where my in-laws live because my friend was watching their dogs. Everybody, all my family was already gone to California for a wedding and I was gonna fly out the day after the concert to go to the wedding the day of. And so um, no one was home, like, so it was just like, okay, no one's here. So every, somebody's watching the dog. So I went up, got ready at their house and then I brought my friend Katie to the concert and she had never heard of Morissette. She didn't know who she was, never heard anything by her. And so she was just like, completely shocked and that was so fun because to have someone listen to Morissette for the first time and for it to be live, it was pretty cool. So I also brought along my friend Aaron, who I met in New York when I was there for the Jacob Restituto concert, which if you haven't seen, go and stream it. It's really awesome. He was there doing some videography videography work for Jacob and I and he was telling me that he's gonna come down for Morissette. And so I was like, well shoot, let's all sit together. And so he sat with us and he knows how to speak Tagalog. I always wanna, uh, he said it, he, he taught me how to say it and now I don't know how to say it anymore. It was really great because a lot of the concert, there's so many people there who speak tag along and so a lot of the concert you know they're bickering back and forth and talking and we have no idea what's going on and we're sitting there like this is amazing like it's so fun we don't know what's happening and we're like Aaron Aaron what are they saying what are they saying Eric is saying uh oh I'm so hungry like is anybody in the audience hungry and I'm gonna go I'm gonna go get something to eat and that's how he got off stage to have Morissette and Christian sing a couple of songs together and so we didn't know what was going on he just like all of a sudden left and so Aaron was telling us what he was saying. So it was really, really helpful and fun to have someone there who knew what was going on too, but it was also fun to kind of be in the 
not know because I don't know it's so awesome to see everybody interact like it's such family there and everyone is so loving and kind it was it was amazing so I have a couple clips that I think we should watch together I think it would be fun to kind of go back and listen to a couple of things from the concert and see like what I think about them now because I haven't really listened to them since I recorded them and something that was really crazy that I wanted to say was I was not expecting any of them to come into the audience and they come into the audience and people are just like swarming them. Like they're up from their seats, they're swarming them. There's no security around. And me, I'm over here like, oh my gosh, there's no security. Like, what, are they okay? Like, are they gonna be okay? <laughs> Everybody's just loving them, like wants to take pictures and everything. But you know, we're just like, oh my gosh, this is crazy. Like they're getting like mobbed and like everyone's just coming at them, wants to take a picture and it was so fun. Um, and Morissa was singing this one song and I just don't understand how she was singing, belting such a crazy song. She's just over here like taking selfies and taking pictures and stuff. It was truly, truly amazing. And so let's go ahead. We're gonna take a listen to some of these songs. Some of them are in Tagalog language, I believe. And so I didn't know what it was called. So you can let me know down below what's it called and get into some of these songs. <music> Here we go. A little bit of I will always love you. Oh, so good. Let's do it again. <laughs> Before we go to this amazing, hold on, I gotta pause it, I'm sorry. I wanna say, point out something. I think I just realized that of how little of breath she takes during that whole chorus after listening to it a couple of times. Um, we must go back and listen to this again. I want to point out how strong her vocals are when she goes into the chorus here and then how she flips so easily into her mixed voice. It is just absolutely perfect. When she did and anything in her mixed voice this night, I was just like, wow. This is amazing. Okay. such an echo on her mic, it was amazing. Yeah. So they actually did an entire medley from the Titanic. Like there was like all of these songs that came out. So Eric sung one, she sung one, and then Christian sung one, and then they came together and sang as well, which was really fun. Okay, I think this video is already like pretty long. So if you wanna see some more videos, from the concert, then comment down below and I will react to a couple more. I think I have a Kinkana Lung. That would be a fun one for us to react together to. But I'll stop the video here so we can, we can, if you have any questions, you can ask me. I can make a new video and answer any questions you might have about the concert. But I hope you guys liked this. It was so much fun to go. Um, I will definitely go again. 
when she comes here again, it was absolutely amazing. I still hope one day that I can visit the Philippines. I would absolutely love, love to go to the Philippines to see and meet everyone there and see more inside again. But thanks guys so much for watching. Please make sure to give this video a big thumbs up if you liked it. Don't forget to subscribe and remember that one of the best ways you can support my channel is by visiting my Patreon. Thank you to all of my Patreons. Thank you so much for your support. I really appreciate it. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. Thank you.